Hello everyone, it's Old Guardian here. In this Hearthstone Mercenaries task guide, I'm going to take a look at Warmaster Wound Task 17. Yeah, deal 980 damage to adjacent enemies using Axtro. So, it only counts Axtro, Axtro cannot be buffed, and it only counts the damage that you deal to the adjacent enemy. So, yeah, this one is pretty painful. There are basically two ways to do the task, either you just play with one normally and wait until the task eventually gets completed, or you head to Heroic 1-1. One -one. So you can shoot at the Quillbore and the add is a blue, so one deals critical damage to that, and because only the second damage counts, then that's all you need. Although you do need some healers to go alongside Vaughn, so I'm using Vaughn, my equipment doesn't matter, Cyrella, my equipment doesn't matter, and Gigi with Blazing Band, but really, equipment doesn't matter in this one either. Alright, Vaughn Task 17, here we go. I really like doing this with Gigi so that I can stack the heal power and extra always to the green, so the adjacent minion that takes the damage is the blue one, so that that counts for the quest line. And Cyrilla is a convenient healer, Cyrilla is same speed as Axtro, so then I can just keep healing that one, and Gigi starts to stack some heal power. So I can also shoot my own minions here to get some heal power, then Gigi will be able to use AoE heal to keep all of these up, while Cyrilla will main heal here, but then Cyrilla will, when needed, also heal this one, and then I will need to take one turn off from Axtro every once in a while. But that's totally fine. And just do it like this, keep stacking that heal power. The more heal power I have, that means that Cyrilla will be then able to heal the green fighter to full with a single heal, which will be really useful. So just keep healing and keep stacking heal power. Right, and keep shooting there, keep healing there, might do a bit of inspiring song for a change here, just keeping my own minions also up and healthy. And at this point I could take one turn break and use a flash heal over there, actually I don't even have to take a I do have to take a break at this turn or the next. Well, I might take a break this turn. And this one just keeps stacking that heal power. Oh, heal power the merrier. Healed to full there. See, pretty sweet. Then this flash heals. And I might stack a little bit more heal power. I don't know how much more do I really need. I guess 40 ish is pretty good. Nah, this looks really, really sweet at the moment. And well, this is this is basically it. Bit of that heal power stacking. And then G keeps my stuff healthy. Every once in a while I have to take one turn where I don't use Wands ability. So I can keep everything healed up very nicely. Chum chum, and we can do an inspiring song here. 38 healing to my own character, so yeah. That's just how it goes. And just repeat this like 70-ish times, depending on how many how many extras you managed to pull off before you got here. And yeah, I know, I know. It's just how it goes. But this is the process. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the content, please click the like button, subscribe to my channel, and check out my Twitch channel.